Good afternoon, viewers. It's actually Saturday afternoon, isn't it, Tom? Yeah. And we're out with my wingman, Tom, my local apprentice, and he's got us this big field to go out. No, I've never been on it. Tom's never been on it. We're going to dodge a few little showers. Good luck, good luck, Tom. I did put it on my Facebook yesterday. But yesterday, 17th of November, was Buster's 18th birthday. What a marvellous milestone, son. Have you got anything to say to your fans? Yes. Message me, Dad. And send me a Christmas card because you missed me birthday. All right, Bunty. I'm sure some of them will. God bless you, my sweet lion. 18. Blooming 18. Second target. Second bit of crap. Uh, the darker green is a bit long, uh, where it's been sprayed off or whatever, where it's lighter on this stripe, it's not too bad. This is the same farm I was out with Tom on last month, the farm where I famously shit my pants. Um, <coughs> happened to the best of us, can't it? Um, and those fields, although they produced a couple of Roman bits, I found out they've been heavily detected in the past. Now the farmer's got hundreds if not more than that acres round here all spread out so this this field is like about a mile and a half from them ones that where I've been detected don't know if this has um, but he's got other farms in different counties as well we'll get on one of his fields one day that produces he's got to be tenacious hopefully today got a live reveal here Oh, oh, look at that! Live reveal of a bona fide Mewtube. I am absolutely blown away with that Mewtube by this wind. I'm sorry I didn't bring my wind mic out. I will try and do this and that. It probably won't work. You'll probably switch off around about 10 seconds ago. And for those that don't, you're my mate. Something in the cloud here. I don't know whether you can see it shining. I'm not sure what it is yet. Uh, I'm not sure what that is. If uh, anybody anybody recognises that, can they drop in the comments, please, on this windy windy cloud shot? Oh, I'll, I'll give it the silver test when I get in, see if it's silver. It has got writing on. Well, there you go. My first anything that is an out and out rubbish. It's not a keeper, but at least it's a bit of lead. Got a live dig, live dig with Tom here. Wherever that is. That's got to be off uh, a big old fashioned fire surround or something, Tom. You reckon? Yeah, He's something. probably having a beer at the same time, look. Yeah. <laughs> well done, mate. Not really. And uh, Tom. <laughs> Tom just reminded me what he told me a few weeks ago about this field. Uh, the farmer, when he was a young nipper, a little whippersnapper, was playing in this brook behind me and he unearthed a human skull. Obviously, the police were called immediately and they said, oh, it looks a bit old for us, that. And it got dated, Saxon skull, right here. Uh, I just found this on the surface. Almost looks like glass, but don't know. Kind of. Feels like glass. Don't know whether it's glass or pottery. Don't know whether it's old. The Romans uh, used glass, remember? They had some lovely glass vessels. Where are you going, Bunt? Look at that dog. He's an absolute stalwart. He don't care that he can't see or hear. He don't care that he's 18. I care though if he bloody walks off into something. Or is it? No, he's not having a crap. He's not having a crap, viewers. He's looking for his dad. I'm literally 20 foot away. He ain't got no clue. Oh, see him flinch then, you might know him of. Oh, did you pick 
Cook up me son, oh god bless you. Uh, no look, he didn't. He just walked right past me when we were in about a foot. You got half a clue, look, daddy here. Yeah. Daddy here, yeah, look. Oh yeah, you got your daddy now. You're happy aren't you Bunty? My little man, dog, child. Angel. Oh I loves him. Anyway, switch the camera on to just keep you abreast of these absolutely jaw-dropping finds on the new Saxon skull field. Uh, yeah, that's going to be the title of the video. No, not pure shite. Saxon skull field. It come out of that blooming brook there, and it's true. Yeah. <sighs> Oh, I press record instead of taking a picture for the thumbnail. I'm sorry, bud. Well, the good old English Met Office said it was going to be sunny today. And it's actually raining a fair bit. And my coat's about a quarter of a mile away in the car. And he's got his own. Uh, I'm going to swing up by the car and then decide whether we're going to carry on with this Saxon school camp slow field today or come back to it on the 12th of November. A bit more lead, Bumblebee. A bit more lead. To tell, even though he's from Spain, he's a proud uh, Briton now. He's assimilated nicely into his adopted country. Lead. Poppy. Dog. Deus. Spade. Dickhead. That's a good boy, Bunter. Just had a birthday shit. Or belated birthday shit. And uh, talking about stuff like that. Here's the top of an old moo tube from about 1900 maybe. Bunter always does this. I put a jacket down to save my seat a bit. And he just rags it. Yeah, he just rags it all off and just messes my seat up anyway. He loves digging. He digs on the couch, he digs on the bed, he digs, he sometimes digs on me as well. When are you going to dig me a hammy bunt? Well, that was just a quick little hunt because I didn't get out last weekend and yeah, I'm rocking my broken glasses again. What do you expect from old Anglo? itinerant dosser celtic you know quick little hunt today with tom scope out that saxon school field um okay we're not going to write it off but uh sticky uh cancel um go back uh another time of the year when the conditions are right um, but we were having a conflab and hopefully between us we'll rustle up some more permissions soon. Sorry I missed last week's video, didn't get out. I've been struggling for about the last month now. Um, I don't know what it is, time of year or whatever, but I just got in a little bit of a rut and then it just... It just went down and down, so I haven't been getting out at all, I haven't been going out the house. Um, apart from to take Buster out and uh, occasionally once a week, if it suffices, uh, do a bit of metal detecting with a mate. But nothing happened last week. So I'm going to try and fight it anyway. And uh, I might just go up to my old pasture permissions in the week just to get myself out of the house. Hope you're all doing well, okay? God bless you all. From me and the 18-year-old Bunty. I'm asleep, Dad. I'm asleep. I just, just thank everybody for all my birthday wishes. All right, Dad. I forgot to show you this, viewers. No, not my mi mirror. This beautiful picture that hangs on the wall. It's a big old picture. Um, Mikey Hayes uh, on YouTube, my buddy Mikey, is uh, Anglo-Welsh metal detecting. He took a screenshot of one of my videos and uh he got that printed out for me that's really really it's just lovely to see 
you know, I'm not so fussed about whether I'm on the ball or not. I'm not that, um, you know, conceited, whatever. But to see Bunty out with, with his daddy there, when we're just sitting at home, making the, editing the videos and that, that's absolutely lovely. Beautiful. So thank you very much, Mikey. I mean it, mate. Absolute, true friendship. I've got a lot of good friends. One or two of them seem to have dropped me like dog shit lately, but that's up to them, innit? True friends. And the bunt, my bestest.